Hey, Kuragane, let me ask you something. More complaining, is it? Come on, don't be like that. Every time I turn around, Velvet or one of the pirates is telling me to go make some delivery to some island. I can never get a break. Isn't that just a sign they think you're a dependable guy? Maybe, but I don't see them sending you off on errands. It's like they take one look at your face and decide to leave you alone. I don't have a face. Oh, right, sorry. A slip of the tongue. Maybe you just don't know how much work I do around here. It's more than you think. Anything to do with iron, I do it. Making tools, repairing things. What do you take me for? Some kind of cheeky freeloader? I don't even have cheeks. <laughs> You're too funny. But doesn't it ever annoy you to have all these kids giving you orders? I've spent my entire life thinking of nothing but forging swords. It's been centuries since I've interacted with youngsters like them. They can be a hassle. But at least, it's a new hassle. Yeah, that's what I thought at first. So I went along with whatever they asked. But I've been too nice, so they keep pushing work onto me. Maybe if I hadn't been so helpful, they would have stayed out of my face like they stay out of yours. I don't have a face. That's not the point. Aren't you even listening to what I'm saying here? You need to make up your mind. You and I got on this ship alongside these people, who are putting themselves in great danger in order to live the lives of their choosing. If you don't like it, then go on and get off this ship with your tail between your legs. Yeah, except I don't have a tail right now. <laughs>